It's a coffee. Oh, we got it. Let's not even wait for a what moment. We, are? we, we are in the moment. What are we, we're in the moment right now. All right, guys, with sipping with Sakari. We're going to sip with Sakari, and you know we have to have the best mezcal. Look at this. Look at this. La Leyenda. Talk, talk about it, Tom. This is La Leyenda means the legend, and what's happening with yeah. this is that legends never cut corners. They just okay. don't. You yeah. know what? And they also only do things by giving back to right. their roots. Yeah. Right? That, that's core to any legend. You look at Jerry Rice. Yeah. You know how much that guy gives back to his people? A lot. I'm telling you. Yeah. Back it's to his amazing. hometown, and his family and stuff. Legends are born of excellence and given back. And that's what we're doing here with La Leyenda. The only way you can sustain success is by giving back to your creators. 100%. And that's what we're doing here. This is an NFT agave project. And what we do is the membership goes back to the folks that made the stuff, the community, Incredible. the laborers. We have a multi-sig fund that they can submit projects to. And what we get in return is the world's best agave. And what that means really sharp, and I know a lot of people don't know agave this well, <laughs> but an agave plant is seven feet tall. Yeah. It takes seven years to grow. It's not a potato. Not I always a say, <laughs> it's not a potato. Oh, this boy. thing takes a long time to yep. grow. So that is an artisan. And we talk about NFTs represent artists. Well, we gotta start thinking about food and where our stuff that we put in our bodies as art form. We celebrate our chefs. Absolutely. Right? Ooh, as they're, they're artists. Yes. But how about the farmer? They had just as much to do with it. Where does it come Why from? do we call that an industry? Yeah. Yes. So what we're saying is, no, let's treat the farmer like he's an artist, make him part of the project, yep. and we get better yield. We took this bad boy up to San Francisco Spirit Awards against 600 brands, and we won double gold, which is the top prize. Ooh. Because the 50 judges that tasted it knew you can't, you cannot make up a legend. Can't. That's why we call it a legend. And Thank how, you how so do you much. How properly sip this? Can you just educate yeah. our... Yeah, so here's how we do it. Here's how we do it. This? We let it roll over our bottom lips. Okay. We let it go into the gums, uh -huh. like chewing tobacco. Yeah, why? Because yeah, yeah. that's where the receptors are, right? Okay. And since this has no sugars, it's going to go right in your bloodstream, no like... Right in there. It's beautiful. Watch this. Sipping with Sakari, guys. Mmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That way the alcohol doesn't like over prevail the flavor yeah. of the agave. Yeah. So anytime you sip an agave, keep it up front in, in the in the beginning. Yeah. And then let it come back. Because mm. otherwise there's just too much going on. Right. Right. This is no, we're no longer in the days of lick it, <laughs> slam it, suck it. No, no, no. Yeah, right. We're we're in the sipping mode now. Yeah, we're sipping. Amazing. And that's why we're sipping with Sakari. Tom, thank you so, thank much. You so thank much. Thank you guys. Thank you. Cheers Love to Mezcal. Awesome. Cheers. You guys better be checking this out. Let's go. Sip it with a curry.